Muna? Muna! Where are you? You you are I am worried for that person. Huh? So they are down there. Don't go down there. Down there is the dream of that horrifying mermaid. If you see it, the dream will turn into a nightmare. Moreover, the mermaid stole away your husband's heart. That's why for that person, you don't have to suffer anymore, old lady. Oh, she opened her eyes. Boy. I am... What kind of person do you think I'd be if I gave up searching for that person? I already knew that the mermaid had stolen his heart away. How that mermaid captured those who bear the longing for death, Shikyoku. What a foolish man. I will continue to keep searching for him here. Until I die. We will definitely meet again in a dream. Oh, wow. Huh? And then... The old woman fell into the mermaid's dream. It was a long time coming. She had waited for a long time for the return of her husband. When she found where her husband was, from all the stagnant years, she moved once more. Then, the dream of the Ryokan vanished. In the end, I wasn't able to save anyone. No one. Let's go home. Luna? Where is Luna? Oh, now we're walking! So I guess when the Ryokan vanished, it uh, just left the forest, so we were... Okay, I see. So hopefully Luna's not in a bad place. <laughs> Luna. Really creepy. I hope she's okay. Luna. You too. Where did you go? Big brother. Uh. Oh, we're following the thread. Ah, that's pretty cute. <laughs> You... you are still alive. Aww. Aww. The music is really nice. Oh. You. It was... nothing? Uh, no, the thread is still working. But hey, we found the cat. <laughs> Yay, there's Luna. Welcome back, big brother. Luna. Were you able to 
save the people from the dream? No. I didn't even save one person. No one. Not even Miss Noe. I see. I guess we weren't able to save anyone after all. My brother, you did your best. Let's go home, big brother. The Curse of the Abandoned Rokan The abandoned Rokan's owner went to the mermaid with a longing for death, Shigyoku, and accepted his punishment for all eternity. And that old lady who had stayed behind continues to search for her husband. In order to find him, she was swallowed up by the mermaid's dream. Sure enough, maybe she'll be with him again in there. And that was the end of the mermaid's curse. Just like those Oroko who were in love with that woman. The evidence of the curse can't be found. Humans have to choose it for themselves. Someday, a person who is connected to that real con will appear, and then definitely, they will create a new dream. And then, that new dream will open up for that nightmare. My mother, Mimiko Yumemi, once said something. My power will not be used to cause calamities. She saw one end of the calamity and ran from it to only end up delivering it. And her children, Teru and Luna, both possessed by the same power that they could not escape from. Interesting. Oh, here we are at the credits. I guess that was the end. So that was chapter one, the case of the mermaid. I thought it was very good. They did a fantastic job on all the work. Really, really creepy atmosphere and really good story. A little, little sad for no way. I kind of understand where she was coming from, but you can't reason with someone so full of hate. Oh. Oh, what is this? Oh! To be continued. Oh! <laughs> That's so creepy. Is she gonna come back? Oh my goodness. Alright, so that is the end of chapter one. I just want to thank you guys all for watching this series with me. There are many more chapters on my channel that I have translated. So please check them out. If you really enjoyed this chapter, you will definitely like the other ones. I guarantee it. So until then, I'll see you guys in the next chapter. See you later.